Hi! When you use an embossing folder in your die cutting machine, is it always a guess which side of the cardstock will be embossed? Sometimes it doesn't matter, but sometimes it does, and I'm going to show you how you can know every time. I'm so glad you're joining me today. Welcome to StampingSmiles.com. I'm Shelley Godby, the owner and CEO of Stamping Smiles, and for 16 years I've been teaching others how to create their own hand stamp smiles. So I'm going to show you a couple of examples of when it's important which side is embossed and how to always know when using a Stampin' Up! embossing folder. There are a couple of reasons why you'd want to know which side of the cardstock or paper will be embossed. For example, recently I used the wood grain embossing folder to emboss crumb cake cardstock for quite a few cards. And I definitely wanted that raised edge up. And you may be thinking, well Shelly, what's the big deal? You just turn it over. Well, in this case it made a difference. Uh, for one of my 12 weeks of Christmas projects, I was trying to get the spacing just right and printed on a lot of crumb cake cardstock and yep, I kept it because it didn't bleed through, the ink didn't bleed through, it was perfectly fine, but I had to know which side was going to come out embossed. And actually that's what got me thinking about how you might like to know this tip too. Here's another example, the gold foil sheets really pretty. The gold is one on one side and white on the other. So if I want embossed polka dots, I really need to know which side's going to come out. And there's another reason. There are some techniques where you um, put ink right onto the embossing folder. Well, you need to know which side, right? So let me grab my Big Shot. Oh, here it is. And let's show you. So we're going to start with the Big Shot die cutting machine and then we need to build up our sandwich. So I have the Big Shot platform cutting pad and our embossing folder. Okay, so the side that has the Stampin' Up! logo is when that's facing up, okay, you put your cardstock or paper in with the side that you want to be embossed also facing up, and so I want the gold embossed, and I have raised polka dots, and there we go, close that. Another cutting pad and then we'll just crank this right through. And here we have big old polka dots on the gold side. And so, like I said, you really want to know that so you're not wasting your gold foil sheets so you can make pretty cards like this. The next time it's important which side of the cardstock or paper is embossed, look for that Stampin' Up! logo, and so you won't waste any materials or time. And if you'd like more of my stamping tips, well then subscribe to the Stampers Insider. It's your free stamping source for inspiration, information, and ideas. Just go to www.thestampersinsider.com. I'm Shelley Godby, teaching you how to create handstand smiles. Thanks for watching.